Hey, what's up, my little title tells? How y'all doing today? Well, baby, if you are Kourtney Kardashian, you are sh shading the F out of Kim Kardashian. What am I talking about? If you guys don't know, Kim's been involved in a little scuffle with North looking like the worst mom of the year. Now, listen, we all can acknowledge Kim loves Northy, but Kim also loved Northy literally sitting on the side of the road like a puppy she was trying to get rid of. Also, she could make her photo met gala call. Girl, you were supposed to be the queen of the Met Gala. You couldn't literally just switch places with someone to make sure that your daughter wasn't standing outside while thousands of people were screaming at her. I'm just asking, right? But the whole point of that is Kim has received a lot of flack for it. And people have been shading her. I just didn't think Courtney was going to be the one to shade her. Now, listen, I'm going to show y'all what Courtney posted just to show you where the shade came from. But also, why is Courtney doing this? Well, if you guys don't know, Kim, right? If you guys don't know, Kim, people are saying, shaded Courtney about her Las Vegas wedding. Kim couldn't show up for her Las Vegas. She didn't show up for the courthouse one. And she only showed up, according to Courtney, at her actual wedding to use it as a business opportunity and steal her Dulce and Gabbana collab. Y'all, listen, let's get into this mess. But before we do, you guys, I am trying to grow. If you've been visiting my channel for a while, please hit that like or subscribe button. We can catfish YouTube. If you want, you can unsubscribe when I hit 200K. And if you're new to the channel, just listen to the video. I, I promise I'll establish value by the end of the video. Also, I will be recapping Keeping Up With The Kardashians and Real Housewives of Atlanta if you guys are into reality TV plus all the gossip. Okay, fine. I'll get into the gossip, okay? So let's start off with the first slide. Kim shading the F out of Courtney. If you guys don't know, Courtney had a whole rock and roll wedding in Las Vegas. For some reason, and I don't know why, right? Because Travis seems, according to everybody else, to be a really, really stand up guy. But for some reason. Okay, so I pulled up the 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 pictures, okay? So Kim post first of all, congratulations to Chris. Um, Anna's husband for getting married. It seems like a total um, glomming of Courtney's rock and roll Vegas wedding. But again, Courtney doesn't own that aesthetic, whatever Travis Barker does. Anyway, Kim posted, posted a picture of herself in a leather vest, right? Giving her L viral realness. Basically, she's doing, um, I'm sorry, Kim posted basically doing Courtney cosplay. She first posted this with the pictures. There's no one I would have officiated a rock and roll Vegas wedding for other than Chris Appleton and Lucas Gage wrote Kim, right? And everybody was like, seems odd, seems shady. You know that Courtney got married at the exact same courthouse when she did. Courtney, it was just her and Travis, right? When she did, none of the Kardashians liked the picture. None of the Kardashians spent, sent well wishes. None of those Kardashians even went, oh my God, I love it. It's so beautiful. It was silent. But now Kim is making a big deal out of this. A lot of people said this was crazy shade, right? Especially since Courtney and Travis had a similar theme wedding, right? So after people started dragging Kim in the comments, like, what? How do you Right? Kim then changed it to, I was so honored to be able to officiate a wedding in Vegas. Couldn't be happier for you both. Again, everybody saw the shade and Kim had to change this whole thing. Now, again, we know that Courtney right now is mad at Kim. If you think that she's not, baby, you you haven't been paying attention. We first started it on this channel, shout out to S Tattletales last year, but Courtney came and confirmed it because that's one thing Courtney's going to do being an Aries queen. She's going to confirm some mess and stand 10 toes down in it. We'll see what Miss Lieber Kim has to say about it. However, Courtney saw that and she said, you want to throw shade? You want to throw shade? How about we talk about who's a better woman? You want to talk about you? There's nobody else you would officiate a wedding for. How about we talk about, is there anybody else you would be a mother for? Courtney posted these pictures on her Instagram. Y'all, they are so good to me. Courtney posted these pictures basically saying that she lets her kid be a kid. That's what people are saying. 
she posted these pictures of Penelope saying mother daughter trip to Paris, France, February, 2020. This was during Paris Fashion Week. This was a time that Penelope could have been on the red carpet, could have been doing this, but she, people are saying that Courtney was basically showing Kim, this is how you correctly parent. This is how you let your daughter partake in all the fun, but still be protected and still be a child, right? Here's Penelope, listen, in the lap of luxury. She has all her cute little wardrobes. I will say one thing. I actually think out of all the Kardashians, I do think Courtney always had the nicest natural style. I'm talking about even evolution. Y'all talking about, oh, Courtney used to have a Stepford wife, a J. Crew style. She only did that because she was with Scott. She likes having aesthetic, but she was the one that dressed Kim, even when Kim was tacky, but it was cute for back then, you know? Anyway, she showed they had a gorgeous suite in Paris. She showed Penelope being a kid, eating spaghetti, having fun, lots of croissants, lots of food. This might even be shade because people are saying that Kim, for some reason, has had a build a body for so long that she doesn't understand the way actual real growing bodies look. And the fact that if you look at the pictures of North when she is standing with Kim now, she North like swivels herself up not to look like attractive or anything but you could tell that kim's giving her um uh tips on how to pose so she doesn't look straight up and down which is like kim do you not know what a growing little girl's body goes through every little girl gets thick in the middle as you are growing up and then you thin out and get your curves at anyway i'm not doing this right the same counselor or psychologist that told kim that it was okay to introduce pete davidson to her kids six months after meeting why she's in the middle of one of the messiest divorces in the world can explain adolescent development but but also you notice that kim, the north when she takes pictures with kim now and they're on the right carpet north goes like this look at it north hollows her cheeks and she swivels to give her more of a shape north doesn't do that naturally her mama clearly taught her how to pose again this is my issue with people that actually have build a beer bodies and this is, listen, your body, your choice, but it does give people body dysmorphia. They start to, I feel like they've always had that body. It's always looked like. They forget what they used to look like. And then they start judging others along the lines of what they judge. Penelope is dipped. She has her little fingernails. Look, they're even in this during fashion week while all this hoopla was going on, Penelope was under a tent by the fireplace playing um, fortress and even that, she was there with her and they had the best time. People are saying that this is Courtney dragging Kim, basically hitting Kim where it hurts. Kim is always saying that Courtney's lazy. Courtney doesn't work. Courtney's the least interesting uh, to look at, right? And Kim's this big mogul. However, Courtney was hitting back, being like, Kim, what are you talking about? Me and Penelope, right? are good and you might be the bigger mogul but baby it looks like i'm the better mo mother because my child wasn't waiting out on the street she was nice and chill in the car with me having the time in her life baby listen i can't wait for this new season of keeping up with the kardashians don't forget my real housewives of atlanta review is going to be up tonight so if you guys don't want to watch the show watch the review then decide if you want to watch the show all right guys listen let me know what you think in your comments and i will talk to you later bye